for those rooting activities, I actually have to do something. But what I'm doing is very specific to what my overall mission is, what my objective is, and what my goals are, right? So if you take this on another level and you say, okay, I want to create a, I want to be able to connect with my clients and customers on a very regular basis. So that's my mission. I want to be able to connect with my clients and customers on a regular basis. But in that objective, instead of me talking about how much money I want to spend, let's talk about how much money I want to make, right? So I want to make, I don't know, let's say I want to make $20,000. I want to make $20,000 by connecting with my clients and customers, my existing contact list. So my strategy to be able to connect with my clients and customers and also make $20,000 is that I'm going to send them emails, right? So in order to send them emails, my rooting strategy number one is to pick an email, right? I want to pick an email where, where I'm communicating from. So my email is mail at vivianolden.com. That's my email. So my next rooting activity is that I need to be able to talk to a lot of people at one time. Oh, sorry. I have like my microphone in my head. I want to be able to connect with a lot of people at one time. So to be able to do that, I want to use a bulk mailing service. So I'm choosing to use MailChimp. So that's my rooting activity two, is that I'm going to get and use MailChimp. My rooting activity number three is that I need to write an email, right? So I'm going to write email to be able to connect with my audience and to be able to make $20,000. Cool, right? So now, rooting activity number four is that I want to, um, I want to be able to nurture an existing relationship so even though I want to connect with my audience in a broad sense I also want to re-engage people that I've already done business with so what will I do now so in those four rooting activities I am going to accomplish my mission which is to connect with my clients and customers and also to reach twenty thousand dollars But you know what? Instead of me being able to procrastinate because I know I want to connect with people, now I have actual activities that I can execute to get to my goal. But even better, I have four activities that I can use that will all equally help me reach my goal. So I have a little bit of flexibility. And even better, if I do all four, I'm more likely to reach my goal. So instead of procrastinating, use the Flourish Method, break down your plan into a mission, objective, your sewing strategy, and your rooting activities. Now I've already broken all of this down into a kind of popular planner that I use with my clients, and that planner is available right there. So I'll go ahead and make that available to you. So if that plan sounds good to you, or if you want to see how you can reach your goal, your objective, and get you know a couple dollars in your pocket or collect some coins, you can actually use my TSGS, which is available right there in the link. And the TSGS was actually designed and implemented by an MIT computer programmer. So with that objective, you'll be able to find out how many people you actually do need to connect with in order to reach your revenue and profit goals in your business. I hope you found this information useful. Please subscribe or give me some ideas right below and tell me if you would like to see more videos like this one or if you would think I should give you a discount code to be able to purchase the Flourish Planner, the Daily Flourish, which has this Flourish method as well as some other techniques that I use in my business. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.